Hey guys, it's Secure Chicken here. I'm back for my surgery and all rested up and whatnot. Um, something did happen. I was actually going to record and upload this. Well, not this particular, but I was going to record this and, you know, upload yesterday. But uh, when I finished recording, I saved and then it crashed for some reason and then my files got corrupted so I had to start all over which wasn't that big of a deal I wasn't even that far into the game so you know yeah this is locked uh, but uh, instead of because you know I could have just kept going without recording and then uh, um, you know still use that recording but it was I was really lost and uh, I kept, you know, I didn't really know what I was doing. There's nothing in this room, it's just a dark room. But I did read a sign outside that said, keep the door closed, which it's not. Unless they mean a different door. Then I don't know what they mean. Whatever. There's nothing really in this room. My inventory is going to be different because, like I said, I, uh, I, I changed. Or, you know, I started a new file. Different things happen. I want me to keep different things or to use different things. So I'm just going to this back. I don't know why, but that's bothering me. Okay. Uh, let's reload. So I do know know what to do, you know, for a bit. Nothing uh, too s suspenseful. You don't get to hear me scream. I don't think I even screamed. Upstairs. Classic was an evil. The other thing was about like 25 minutes long. Let's see if I can cut off a little bit. I can't enter that door right now. I'll let you guys see this. Something is written on the mountain. The god of the sun and the god of the moon. Their gaze upon me is the only thing that can release the red soul. And I didn't know what to do exactly at this part. I wasn't thinking about it. You know, I was, I was stuck. I just came back. I reread it because I wanted to do it. So I was like, I need to get that now. And this statue represents the god of the sun. And the other one, come on, man. The other one represents the god of the moon. And they both need to be staring at him, which they're not. So you just gotta move them back. At first, I thought you just gotta move them back. Then I noticed while I was moving them, the little pad there, as you can see. So you just gotta put them both onto the pads. You'll hear a little noise signifying that you've done something. I do not know what the jewel is for yet. I haven't gotten that far. I just know how to get it. And at the point where I'm at right now, I'm pretty sure I don't know what to do either. But there's a few rooms I haven't checked, but we'll get into that later. We're just starting out. Then he drops it. It feels good to be back, by the way. Been sticking updated with everyone's LP so lately. Reassuring that I haven't been gone from YouTube. I've been since my surgery. I've checked the first like day and a half. I didn't feel like getting up. It was really bad. Then after that, uh, I was fine. I mean, I couldn't talk for like five days, and then I could finally talk again. I hear noises. Hopefully, the sounds fixed. But it feels like every time I s actually play the game, the sound resets itself. I put it like really low in the main menu. And then, uh, it resets. Which, you know, is pretty annoying. It's in this room. It's just the, uh, yeah, it's communication room. Let's see. I don't really remember what's in here. Oh, yeah, you can see the characters from Resident Evil 1. The, starting from the right, I don't know who that guy is. Barry in the red vest. Underneath him is some guy. <laughs> uh, left of Barry, I'm pretty sure that's a Wesker. Underneath Wesker, that's Jill. And the next to Jill is Chris. And I don't really know the other characters' names. I do remember their faces, though, from the really corny video from the original number one, not the remade one. Oh, I'm so glad they remade that one. That intro was horrible. That was on my PSP, and I kind of kept it as a joke. 
I, I, I don't know why, I just, I can't handle the voice acting, it kind of makes me want to quit sometimes. So, I need to, I want to beat that game though, because I've never actually beat it myself. I've just seen my dad beat it several times, and I've mentioned before, he's the reason why I'm, you know, into this kind of stuff. And that is a Gibson Les Paul over there, which I really would love to have. Chris's Diary. You guys can read this. This is a common thing, though. Ooh, and a big giant chocolate coin. No. A unicorn coin. The most feminine type of coin you can have. It's good to see you're still among the layers here. It looks like we're not gonna find your brother here after all. I should have turned up the BGM louder than the music. You can barely hear them talking. There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up, look for any or survivors, what I just get said. out of here. I don't know what BGM is and the other one right. is. One last thing. Here's a radio. Take it. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. What doesn't make sense is that, uh, you just gave him your radio, or her, your radio, and there's not a radio. You don't see Leon grab another radio. I'm pretty sure officers only carry one radio at a time. Last time I played this, I had like a full inventory. And I had to keep going back to the storage room. This is all destroyed. And here's the second shotgun of the game. I guess if you didn't get the, the first one, you can go ahead and get it there. So yeah, I'll go out and fight the monsters. Whatever, I'll let you stay here. Uh, her time will come soon. Go watch a LP of Claire's version. Alright, Leon can sit around and do nothing. And dead. I am interested in trying out her side of it too. I'm sure I'm not do wouldn't be doing the same things. Maybe at this point I would be. The intro would be totally different. Spade is etched into the hole. So now we have to turn back. Because now I'm back. Back in the time. Okay. Uh. And the store says, uh, the novel turns, which means it's unlocked, but it's uh, blocked from the other side, which doesn't make any difference, because if you're on the other side, you could just unlock it, and if it was blocked like it is, you could just move the stuff. Uh, so yeah, we're going to go back now. Oh, feel free to always tell me if I missed something, if you noticed, if I forgot a little item, just tell me what room, I'll go pick it up. Okay, we haven't been here yet, have we? Or have we? We've been here. It's the back room, because I came out, and then there's a zombie girl behind me, right there. Now we're in Diamond Additional. Never mind. We're going back. Hope I don't get lost again. Okay. Last time this freaked me out. It scared me so bad. Ah. <laughs> I made me jump again. I saw that coming and it made me jump. I don't know why, but that freaks me out. And I did the same exact thing as I did last time I recorded this. I ran back into this room. Okay. Freakishly long arms that look very veiny. I don't know if they're supposed to be bloody. So yeah, I pretty much guess is that a that as an indication that you, you do go back because whenever you know something's different, a spade. Is whenever something is different like that, when you go back to a place, you know it's always if it's changed, that means you were meant to go back. Usually what it means in a video game. I was rambling really bad. Okay, there's another room. Okay, there's that door. And there's another door. And I'm... Is it, it's over here. We could also do something with the fountain, which I won't show yet. 
do that at the end. I just want to cover everything that I can first before I go to a different area. So you can have an option of going to this place or the other one. Just wasting so much ammo. I don't see any way of getting past these guys. Yeah, someone told me I should probably save ammo, which is always good advice, but I don't know. I tend not to. Just gonna go in this room. Big blue door. What's in here? A zombie. If I remember this. If I remember this, I'm asking you guys. Damn it. No. No. No other guy get in. Dang it. They all came out like perfect times. Uh, you're not dead. So I'm falling for that. And I haven't been in this room. In my other recording. At least I don't think so. Is that a really bad memory? Okay, we're gonna... Let's see, how much health do we have? We're only at caution. I'll save the double thing. Dang it. Uh, not good. Ah. Is that a glitch? Or does that happen every once in a while? Screw it. I'm gonna get annoyed at running slightly slower. That was creepy. I saw some thingies right there. You guys totally know what I'm talking about. Is that a fax or an answering machine? Yeah, I saw you. I'll take you back with me. Uh, I could, could have swore this thing would have been a little bit more interactive. Just because of the little light. It's very noticeable. And that's a door leading to creepy hallway. Let me just randomly spam the action button. These guys twitch out. Which makes you think they're gonna get up later. That one's dead dead. He doesn't even have an arm. Not having an arm makes you dead dead. Crap. if I've gotten that already or if uh what are you yeah. green herb always good always good oh another green herb well that's kind of sad uh you can't sit down things anymore well Note for later if I ever run out of health. Or if I lose just room for one item, I can go ahead and put that in there. Did I already get that code? Or do I remember getting that later? I'm gonna have to look in those files. And there's another green herb. Uh, you'll be left for later. At least I know I got health around there. I most likely won't be dying anytime soon. Something just punches my face off. Ah. Uh. That's why I hate running down these hallways. Oh, um, a little news update for my life. If you, wow, that's horrible. If you even care, my dog just had puppies about two nights ago. Seven. It's a little Chihuahua pug mix. Had seven puppies. I don't know how she did it. Then again, I don't know how a woman gives birth. It just seems way too painful. I'm a man, though. I don't have to worry about those kind of things. Is he dead? 
dead, dead. Your blood spill didn't get up. Or do that one thingy. I always indicate things as thing, thingies. Stop doing that. That's locked. Diamond. And there's the red river that I remember. And that if I had one room, I could combine it with my green herb and make. Well, you guys know. Well, I'm sad. Uh, I need some room. Nothing special on the shelf. One of those two-way mirrors, I think. I don't really know why I'm clicking around. Unless there was ammo. That door feels oddly placed, like... Okay, this side that I'm pointing at would be the wall that doesn't have the window on, and this one would be. And then right there is a door into, you know, going into that room. Oh, that's right here. <laughs> yeah. Never mind. That makes sense now. It's locked. Club. Let's see, we got all our cards out. Like wood on the windows doesn't make me feel any safer. Or like a blockade 2x4 thing on the window it does not make me feel safer at all, to be honest. It makes me feel more creeped out than anything. Okay, well, we're probably ending up on around. You know, we're probably somewhere around 15 to 20 minutes, so I think I'll just end it here. Next time, I'm going to go put some stuff away, grab that key, and then show you what's so special about this uh, little well thing right here. So, uh, this is Insecure Chicken, and I'm back. It feels good to be back, and I still love all you guys. Thanks for all your uh, little, I hope your surgery thing goes well, thing, comments on my last video. It really meant a lot to me. Bye.